Let's take a quick trip through the zoo, shall we? Hello everyone! Kazeboy88, Chris if you prefer. Welcome to the Louisville Zoo. As I already showed you with the sign. But <laughs> that's okay. Um So, I haven't been here in a while and I don't think I've ever vlogged here, so figured great day to come out, except that I've been planning to come out here all week. Uh, because I had some time off, it's been kind of warm, and naturally today it got cold. So, of course. But I have gotten here basically I, 20 minutes after uh, the zoo opened. And uh, so basically I'm going the reverse way. There's no like correct way to go through the zoo. But they have like this path that most everybody takes. I'm going opposite of that. So basically right now, the zoo's totally empty, uh, which is pretty cool. So I'll, let's see what we can see. This is the lemurs, but uh, I don't think they're out. It's, it's pretty cold. It's like, it's like 40 degrees today, which I, I, I would feel for the lemurs is probably, probably pretty cold. So they're probably not out. I don't, I don't think I saw any on the other side either. Nice big rock though. And there's the carousel, um, which is closed right now. Um, probably because of the weather more than anything else. Um, I mean, I would assume it's probably because of the weather. But it's pretty cool, it's really old. Um, and then for Halloween, maybe one time we can vlog during Halloween, but they make it go backwards. Um, so that's kind of cool. They're supposed to be warthogs. I wanted to make a Pumbaa joke. Yeah, I don't know how many animals we're gonna see today. It's, it's pretty, pretty damn cold out. Um, but as you can see kind of here, there's just, it's all just super muddy, lots of puddles. We've had these insane storms so, uh, pretty much the past like four days. And rhino statue and no rhinos. Although, while I'm here at this rhino bit, here's one corner, there's the other corner. These rhinos need room to run. Like, they, they just kind of get to sit around all day. They, they, they need some room to run. Although I can, I can say the zoo did just announce like a, a 20 year expansion plan. So maybe they're, they're gonna get some more room. Sacre bleu invaders. So it says here, the wild crane comes in flocks of 10 to 40 We have one. I did not see any giraffes outside, so that usually means they're in here. There's a giraffe. Hi, buddy. Just kind of walking around, just, just kind of hanging out. Oh, I gotta get some food. I'm not convinced this guy's real. He's called a Hyrax, but I'm not convinced he's real. Oh, he rocked back and forth. Maybe he is real. Rock once if you're real. Ooh, now he's holding still. Okay. Oh, oh, there's a rock. You're real. 
there's the other giraffe. Well, another giraffe. I think we have like three or four, but there's another one. Just kind of roaming around. King of the plains. Well, maybe not the king, but the tallest one. You gonna reach over? Look, Mr. Frodo. Holy fonts. Just hanging out. Walking around. At certain points during the day, they do some training with them, uh, just to like make sure that they're healthy and, and keep them physically active and stuff like that. So you can watch them do that. Uh, they used to post show times, but I haven't seen any around here. So I don't know if it's sporadic or scheduled or what. Mr. Zebra, what are you doing? Oh, if you guys are curious or care, the zoo is almost nothing but Pokestops and like three gyms. So if you play Pokemon Go, lots of things to do. Some sleepy lions. Well, you're awake, but you're just hanging out. She is passed out though. I'm not trying to say that meerkats are my favorite thing ever, but I could sit here and just watch them be a little family for a very long time and probably not get bored. And this one's on lookout. The tiger. Just kind of prowling around. He's got so much room for activities in here. Yeah, this is what I've run into a lot today. From where it got so cold, a lot of the animals can't deal with it. Uh, so rather than make them deal with it, they just they keep them in where it's warm, which I can appreciate. It makes for not a very like animal-filled day at the zoo, but it's it's nice that they care about the animals. Back in the car after what I would call a successful trip to the zoo. Uh, I don't think there's ever really a time I don't enjoy myself at the zoo, even if I don't get to see a lot. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I, I enjoyed myself, and if nothing else, it's really great exercise, because it's like, if you walk just straight through, it's over a mile, you've got hills up and down. So I mean, it's, it's a great exercise, even if you don't really see anything, and a lot of people will just get a membership and just come walk and then leave. Um, but yeah, as I mentioned, or actually, I don't think I mentioned it. I meant to mention it, but I don't think I did. Um, we have a membership, so my plan is to come out a lot more often. Um, so this is just one quick look. Um, I mean, as you saw, a lot of the animals weren't on exhibit, and that happens a lot in the winter, uh, because they do have a lot of animals from Africa, Asia, a lot of warmer places to where when it suddenly jumps from 70 degrees down to 40, 30, 20 and less. Um, and the zoo being open every day, except I think Christmas, maybe Easter, um, they can't deal with it. Um, so they'll do a lot of renovations since the animals have to be inside in the warm. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool uh, that, that that much care is put into the animals. But my battery is about to die. <laughs> uh, so. If you liked going to the zoo with me, go ahead, hit that like button. It helps out a bunch. Uh, hit subscribe. You'll know when it's time for more adventures. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.